finally tonight, if you have ever dreamed of going into space, the dream is a little closer to reality. A team trying to be the first private company to send a person into space and cash in on space tourism set a record today in a test flight over the Mojave Desert. A craft called Spaceship One reached a height of 40 miles. That is 212,000 feet. That also set a civilian altitude record. The pilot, 62-year-old Mike Melville, was briefly weightless. And when he got back safely, he said seeing the sky go from blue to black was the thrill of his life. And he... Three six zero. Two six zero. Ten seconds. Two five seven. Ready. Yep. Three two one. Mark. Land release. Fin feels good. On switch is coming. Mark. Firing switch coming. Mark. Good night. Yes, works good. Copy that. Uh, we suggest you go back to one RCS for now, Mike, if you're happy with the configuration. Okay, gone back to one. We're on a. 
Okay, Mark 1.3. So fairly low frequency, high amplitude uh, swinging around a little. The ping pong ball is doing its job. Here okay, we got 32 knots, we're starting to feel the cue. Okay, forward dump on. Forward dump is on, 49 knots. See that? 135,000 feet, and he's uh, three northwest of Bullman. Okay, Mark 1.9. 95,000. 85,000. Got the trim, got him good. Yeah, I got the trim. The typical vibration happening now. Not too much sloshing yet. 72,000. Alpha jet visual. Copy 60,000. 55,000 coming, Mike, if you want to do feather. Going for the feather. Okay. Feather's on the way down. Oscillations were not bad at all. I was able to damp them easily. Hey, the airport's going to be here at 9 o'clock for 7.5 miles. Uh, correction, 7.5 miles. I'll call you back. Inside. All right, thanks. Feather is locked. Everything's green here. 